Good morning, this is Heather with another installment of R-Rated Reviews. I'm not even out of bed yet, but this review I thought was necessary because I was online shopping while I was waking up. TJ brought me coffee. But there's this company that I never thought I would be leaving a really good review for. And it's probably going to have mixed reviews because it's probably one of those sweatshop, com sweatshop companies. But, you know, I can't help it when I really love a bargain. So, I ordered the, the, short, the short version backstory of how I found them. Was when I did the review on the sewing machine, the shit show review on my sewing machine, where I made my daughter's prom dress for her, the majority of it was because the dress that she wanted was like this $700 couture dress that needed to be ordered six months in advance, yada, yada, yada. But I told her I could make her the dress. If she got something similar, I could, I could do it up. And she wasn't looking for dresses, and she wasn't helping the situation. And it was only when I realized, um, she revealed to me that she had lost her best friend just a few days prior to... <laughs> And she didn't have the heart to look for dresses. I said, I got this. I got this. I'll take over. And I just started ordering dresses, black dresses that looked like the same shape of the dress that she wanted. But I couldn't afford to start ordering dresses from like a hundred different places because I didn't know what she was going to like. And so one of the places that I ordered like two or three dresses from was a site called Fashion Nova. And, you know, I know that the, the kids, those young whippersnappers, shop at these places and I don't normally, but I ordered her a bunch of like two or three black dresses, um, from there. And I knew that some of them would be going back. And at the time I didn't realize that their return policy is exactly what I would have expected. It's kind of a, it's a, it's a shit return policy. Like you can get free shipping on the delivery, but if you want to return something, they'll take returns, but it's within 30 days, store credit only, and you have to pay for the shipping back to the company. So, you know, I want to I wanna jump all over that shit, but I can't because I got my daughter a black evening gown that was surprisingly pretty good quality for like 30 bucks. So that's first of the, so for, right off the bat, I was very surprised at the quality. And so, and what I did to it in that review, I showed you a picture. I had sewed over 200 individual flower appliques down the slits and around the bottom of the dress. Over 250, I think, appliques were sewn individually onto this dress. It didn't fall apart and it held up. So the quality right there was a surprise. Well, I had to send like two or three, two dresses back and I forgot I had store credit. I didn't, completely forgot about it. never thought about shopping there again. But they sent me a reminder like a week ago that I had this $75, um, that's the price, two dresses returned. $75 store credit. So I ordered a bunch of stupid shit because I didn't think I would ever wear anything from this, from this website. So I, I love their pajamas. At the time I had gotten one set of these like onesie pajamas. I'm wearing one to test them out. They were on clearance. I said, I'll spend 12 bucks and see what it's like. Well, I love those pajamas so much that I've been looking for them ever since. And when I got the store credit email, I went on the website and I can tell you, they have some really good shit. I'm like, I'm conflicted. But I'm going to tell you what happened yesterday. Let me get my stuff. I, I, I got out of bed to grab my stuff. Okay, I got my stuff. But before I even go into it. So I placed this order. And I'm using my credit. And for some reason, and I was spending more... It was only like $15 out of pocket after the $75 credit. Because I didn't actually want to spend any money at this place. I just wanted to use my credit. Well, they wound up taking, somehow I screwed up or the website, it was hard. I couldn't figure out how to use this stupid credit. And the entire order for like 100 bucks, or it was actually like $30, like $115 went on to my debit card. And I was, no, TJ's debit card. And I was pissed. So I emailed them. And it was like 3 o'clock in the morning. It's my online shopping from in bed. I got an immediate response at three o'clock in the morning from like a real person. And it was like immediate. 
And they were like, you know, I said, they were like, how can we help you? I was like, the fuck? Are you really there? I said, I need to change my payment. I just put the order through like 30 seconds ago. I know most companies don't eat change things once you get like a 30 minute window. I'm like, please tell me, like, just cancel and reorder, like whatever. Well, they don't do that. And I was bitching, I'm back, and we're going back and forth. I'm like, fuck you, I'll just cancel my order, I'll put a dispute, whatever, blah, 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 blah. You know, I was a little bit of an asshole. <clears throat> don't fuck with my money. Because then I'm starting to think this place is a scam. So I got all that stuff. And I really love all of it. And I went up using the $75 credit on another order that I placed. So I got the most adorable pajamas. I like stuff that says funny shit. This is a, and the, I can't, I'm showing you because the quality of the material is, a, is better than I thought. So I got these pajamas. I love the little, I love Razorback. You know, it's like 1 800 did I ask? And it's like, and then these are the, where are the shorts? Shit. Uh, oh, here. They're like little boy shorts. They have like cell phones on them. I'm showing you these for a reason. This is not like a home review on what I bought. This is where it gets funky. So I got one that has a tank top that says, feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty. <laughs> um, it's not me. It's you. And then, and not a morning girl. Obviously. I mean, this stuff is really soft and really stretchy. It's really, it's comfortable. And I kind of like these little boy shorts. Not when they ride up my chach, but that was the issue. I got four sets from the same brand, uh, just different tank top. The shorts are all the same. This is one pair. The one that says not a morning girl has like need coffee now shorts. They look the same, right? Look at that. They're perfectly the same. Then this is the taco one. It's got like tacos and avocado on it. Here's the waistband on that one. So it's like an inch or two. But same length. Now here are the shorts with the 1-800s that I ask. Like they're monster. They're huge. So to make this easier, let me just show you the small pair against the big pair. Because I got four sets that came with three different sizes for shorts. All, mar all four pairs marked medium, uh, mind you, okay? So four pairs of marked medium, they came in three different sizes. Ugh, three. Two were the same. One had a wider waistband, same length, and then one was just altogether bigger. Obviously, the labels are mismarked. Unfortunately, the two pairs that are the same size, they're like an extra small. <laughs> I can't wear them. I can, but it doesn't look good, and it's like my ass ate the whole fucking pair of shorts, so I can't wear them. So I, I contact the company, and I get you know an email back, like two or three minutes. Uh, sure, you can return those. You know, it's a, a $3.99 for one one return, seven ninety nine for two. I'm like, wait, what the what the fuck? I didn't fuck up. So I get pissed. I start leaving my reviews. I'm like, oh, these are really adorable. You know, three sizes for four pairs. Blah, 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 blah. I'm like, and they want me to pay to return them. I don't really want to return them. I want you to send me the right fucking shorts, and then I'll send you the wrong shorts back. I don't know which ones the wrong ones are though. So I take pictures of all the shorts, because this is all an email. I'm like, let me, let me be smart about this. I send them a very nice email. I said, listen, I really like these. I don't want to return them. I'm not looking for a return. I just want to be able to, to wear them and not feed my ass crack. So I said, these are two pairs, and I took pictures of the comparisons. Obviously, blatant dis, you know, disregard for the, the tag inside. And all of a sudden, like two minutes later, I get an email that says you know, credit has been issued. I'm like, what the fuck is this? The credit came to me before they even had a chance to respond. They followed up with an email that said, we're so sorry that 
our product didn't meet your standard. Like there was an issue with your product, your order, blah, 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 blah. You know, please accept this, you know, this refund. It'll be back to, I don't know if it's going to the card because it was a partial payment on that store credit and par partial debit. Um, $45. They gave me a full refund without asking me to send the stuff back. Now, I don't know if that means some poor little kid in China has got to make four more pairs of pajamas. I'm not sure. But they, I got to keep them and they gave me a full refund. That's some customer service. I mean, I don't know, man. Ulta might want to call them up and find out what their model is because it's not the same. So I love them. They're adorable. There's the quality. These are really soft, but they have the right amount of like stretching given them. And they're like, what was that movie? Crazy Stupid Love. I'm going to show you my pajamas. I can't believe I'm doing this. At this point, I showed you what my face looks like after microderm abrasion. So, no bra, whatever. They're the perfect mix of cute and se sexy and cute. Is that what the, yeah, perfect. So, check these out. The ones I have on that I tried a while ago that I've been looking for, they're onesies. They're fucking adorable. Now, these have, like, unicorns on them that say dream big. I got a plain. These are, like, Henley, like a Henley style with, a, like, a knit, like a stretchy knit. And then I got the full body ones. Now, I haven't worn them. I tried them on, but I haven't worn them yet. I would like to make a suggestion. Can you companies that put these onesies out, can you give me, like, a diaper drop? I don't, I don't want to have to get undressed and naked to pee. I mean, maybe this stuff is designed for younger people and that's why it doesn't work for me because I'm getting old and I pee in the middle of the night. I can't make it through the night. I'm like, I don't know if I'm a baby or if I'm like 90. But I don't want to have to get undressed in the middle of the night. It's cold. Even with the heat on, you get out of a warm bed. Shit does not want to be exposed to have to pee. But so with the shorts, I pull it to the side. <laughs> I'm that fucking lazy. So I'm going to tell you, they're like $5. $5. This one, the full body one, I think was 8 And they're for Christmas. Oh, they're stretchy. They're a light sort of... They're not exactly flannel, but they have like a brushed... Oh, that's soft. Oh, that's really soft. And they're stretchy. I love them. But I, they have dresses. They have clothes. I got, a, I got a turtleneck. I love me a turtleneck. I'm not a fan of mock turtlenecks. I want like a, a turtleneck. I have like a, like a giraffe neck. But I did get this one mock turtleneck because of the way the style is. So it's a sleeveless one and it doesn't, it's not really a mock because you can stand it straight up. This is, I put this on. This is nice. Like, and you don't care what the label says inside? And I fucking don't. This is not $6. Free shipping. So, and the sizes are sort of true. I mean, this is a small, and, it, so, and I got, uh, hold on, I got fuck off socks. So, I was disappointed they had a little bucket hat that was pink and it said, go fuck yourself. That's like one of my famous lines. And it was sold out before I, oh, by the way, they have like sexy shit. I'm not showing you that. I did get some, I did get some, I did get some, I got some, I got some other things too. They have everything. And the shit's pretty cheap. As long as you don't have any, any ethical issues. I don't know where this stuff comes from. I'm making an assumption. I'm going to pretend I don't. I'm, I'm just, I don't know where. I really don't know where it comes from. I don't want to fucking know where it comes from. But, hold on. Hold on. I'm going to turn this over. Hold on. i got to pull this out of my ass first. How cute are these? Oh, got a little, getting, I gotta go to the gym. I gotta lay off the fast food. How cute are these? I mean, they're, they're stretchy, they're comfortable, they're like all one piece, and they're like, they're soft. They're really soft. And you can just, uh, even Chandler can get into these. So, six dollars! So I'm telling you because, Today, well, for I, yesterday, I mean, I get emails a lot. I tried to unsubscribe, and then when I ordered something, it started everything all over again. I got an email, that, and if you forget something in your cart, 
They email you in like 15 minutes. They're like, you forgot something. Here's 10% off. 10% off is six fucking dollars. They don't do that. You know, you get a promo code and the promo code is promo code on whatever's in your cart. There is, there is nothing that's excluded that I have come across yet. Um, by the way, oh my gosh. I ordered two lip liners. Just to give it a try. Because, you know, I, I, if you guys watched, Ulta, Ulta done pissed me off the other day. And I got a survey. <laughs> I, I blew them the fuck out of the water. Like, they're ready. They're calling me to find out what happened. So, anyway, I, I got lip liners for five bucks. Five bucks. They're amazing. I was afraid to say that. I'm like, oh, this is going to be like fucking automatic shit that I used to buy for 90 cents at rock bottom when I was a kid. The lip liners. I'm glad I remembered to tell you because I have to go add some more to my cart. I bought two to try. I am now about to replace every fucking color lip liner that I have from Ulta from this Fashion Nova. Very, very good lip liner. The mechanics of the pencil are great. It's a little bit of a wider lip liner that has... I'll go, fuck it, I'll, let me go get them. Okay. So these are the, the lip liners. I'm kind of pissed right now. Oh, by the way, watch this. <gasps> Another thing Ulta might want to try. You ever try getting those plastic shrink wraps off their fucking eyeliners and lip liners? The fuck? Oh my God. <sighs> It's ridiculous. I don't know if this one looks good or not because I haven't tried it yet. But I will tell you. How am I losing shit? I put, I put the, this is nude and I bought nude pink. I wore nude pink yesterday. I don't carry it with me and I check my bag. It's not in there. I, I wouldn't leave the bathroom with it. It's not in the bathroom. I don't know how I'm losing shit lately. But I actually lost a fuchsia wool coat. I don't even drink. I'm like, TJ, I can't find my fu gorgeous, gorgeous coat. That I got for $5 at a yard sale. I'm like, somebody spent some fucking money on this. Gorgeous coat. Just missing. I'm like, TJ, I don't even drink. So it's not, I, I didn't get drunk and leave it somewhere. Where the fuck is my coat? Now I can't find my lip liner. So it's uh, an angle. Let's see. Goes on like crayon. I'll just fill it in. It's stayed on for hours. I don't have to fix it. Ah! Probably why I don't know where it is. Now I gotta, now I gotta find, now I look stupid, I got no makeup on. In bed in my pajamas, my fucking lip liner. Ah. Five bucks. Fashion Nova. So the email the, that I got with the new, the new stuff, they have these metallic, metallic leggings. They're like metallic faux leather leggings. Not normally my style. They're so fucking hot. I'm like, I have nowhere to go. Like if you order a hundred bucks worth of stuff, they'll, they'll do, they're doing like free one day shipping now. Um, for tip, like two more, they said it was over yesterday and then the clock set today. I fell asleep and didn't order. And when I woke up this morning, I'm like, fuck. And then I'm like, oh, look, they put another clock on. So I have another 20, 24 hours to do, uh, spend some money and you get some free one day shipping. Like I'm like, oh, what a New Year's outfit. Oh, the fuck I think I am. I haven't gone anywhere for New Year's since I was like 21. I like fall asleep. I don't want to see the ball drop. I don't give a fuck. But I have a closet full of clothes and nowhere to wear them. I am not the girl that says I have nothing to wear. I'm the girl that says, I have too many clothes and nowhere to go. TJ, you have to take me out somewhere. Because I, I can't justify my clothes. I don't, you can't take the Long Island out of this girl. I can adapt. Like, for, like you don't know, right now I have chickens walking around my bedroom. Really. Like, <clears throat> but but I'll, I'll adapt. But I'm st I still want nice clothes. And nice doesn't mean expensive. 
So I gave them a try. I took one for the team and I ordered some shit and I ordered enough stuff at this point that I can tell you across different borders and varieties of items they offer. Now, as long as you don't have a conscience or, you know, political eth ethics, I, and I'm not, I'm, I'm joking about the, the slave late, the child labor. I don't, I don't know if they do that or not. I have no idea. So I really, I shouldn't even talk about it, but you know, kids aren't making lip liners. So I've tried the pajamas. My daughter wore a prom dress that was stunning. Um, the makeup is good. The quality of the clothes are good. The top I showed you. So I have a top. I have pajamas. My daughter tried the dress. We tried the makeup. And I can't find the top that goes with those faux metallic leggings for $11.99. They have this top that matches. It's gorgeous. I took a picture. I screenshotted the top because I can't find it on the website. And I emailed them. And I'm like, hi, it's me again. I really want to get these pants. And like, like I have so many places to go. I want to get them in the silver and the fuchsia. But you have that matching top and I can't find it on the website. Is that available? And if it is, can you tell me where to find it? Like 40 seconds went by. 40 fucking seconds. And I got an email back. They were like, thank you so much for, for reaching out to us. We would love to help you. Can you give us some, some information on the item? Stupid. Forgot to attach the photo. I'm like, duh, sorry. That is some shit. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give Fashion Nova and the items that they sell, like, Two wholehearted thumbs up. I'm really, really impressed so far. As long as, they don't, as long as they don't piss me off. They pissed me off a little bit with that credit. That was half my fault. So I, I can't say anything about that. Then I went online today and I, got a, I had to do a review for one more set of pajamas. And I, I, I wish I could change my other reviews. I don't know how to. They, they did right. I did not have to send everything back for $3.99 or $7.99 an item. I, didn't have to, I said they really did right. So this is the last set of pajamas that came with a different size shorts. And I will tell you that they did the right thing. You got custom service, you got quality items, and you got ridiculously, ridiculously cheap products. Like some of the pajamas were 10 bucks, 12 bucks. That's like Macy's on sale. So that's not, you know, the eight bucks. Oh, I got one set for three, three dollars. And I got berets. I got some, five dollars. I got a... I got a raspberry beret. I'm going to go make cookies. That looks like shit. It's going to take some time to figure this out. My box. How do I do this? I don't know. I'll do that later. <laughs> if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them. If you want to hit like or subscribe, I would love that too. And by the way, for the people that used to watch because I was doing all the tool reviews, those are going to come back soon because Christmas is in a couple of days and I think I'm getting some tools. Have a great day. I'll see you soon. Thanks.